Woo! Welcome back, everybody. Glad you're here. Uh, continuing on with Fallout. One episode this week, I believe, because I got a short week. I got to go out of town, so I'm going to get uh, episode four in. Uh, right now, Lucy is with the ghoul. Uh, they're trying to retrieve the head of the target. Uh, Maximus, in his armor with Thaddeus, just fought the gulper, and they're still after the head as well. Um, and Vault 32, the people back in Vault 32 are trying to decide what to do with the raiders that attacked them and they captured. So we're coming up on episode four now. Um, this one is called The Ghouls. So we're going to see more ghouls. Lucy and the ghoul encounter dangerous situations uh, leading to a moral dilemma. They got morals in this show? Okay. And intense confrontations. Uh, Norm uncovers, uncovers secrets in Vault 32, linking back to his mother's past and raising questions about the resident's fate. So there we go. Um yeah, so we're just going to get into it. How are you guys liking it? I'm liking it, man. I'm really enjoying this series. Um, I've been wanting to record these faster, and I just can't get to them. I'm so busy right now, but I'm having fun doing this, so hopefully you guys are enjoying watching this. Do me a favor and leave me a comment below. I'd love to know what you think about it, but if you would, just hit that like button real quick. Helps the algorithm. Helps me get this stuff out. You know how that works. Subscribe if you haven't already. Share it. And uh, most importantly, kick back and enjoy. Here we go. This is episode four, The Ghouls. Oh, there's some big roaches, man. <laughs> My sister would not be able to make it. <laughs> hey, Raj. Hey. <laughs> Fancy seeing you out here. No. Oh. <laughs> you know, it's hard <laughs> out here. You ain't got a smoothie of your own. You're turning. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, you don't have to have any vials, do you? One little puff, and I'll be back on my feet. You don't look for it. I'm sorry, Roger. I'm all out. That's okay. It's okay. Younger, smooth-faced friend might want to clear out before things get ugly. So these guys are like stuck between human and zombie. Twenty-eight years since I first started showing. <laughs> Not as long as you, though. <laughs> you felt less than us all. How long since you first started wastelanding? A long time. Say. Remember how good food used to taste? <gasps> Blam co mac and cheese. Ice cream and apple pie. <laughs> apple pie. <laughs> you know, my mom used to. Saw that coming. <laughs> yeah. Why'd you do that? You are sick. Stop, 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 please. I, no, I know it's hard up here, but you don't, you don't have, you don't have to resort to. What'd you say your name was? Lucy McLean. McLean. Huh. Uh-oh. Well, it ain't all canned peaches and marmalade left up here, sweetheart. Sometimes a fella's got to eat a fella. You know, my vault has endured hardship, too. In the Great Plague of 77, people starved, my mother included. My dad dropped to 128 pounds, and he still refused to do anything like this. Well, as what people say they did, and what they really did, well, I bet your daddy was first in line at the cookout. How do you live like this? Why keep going? Boy, she has some dumb questions. Well, one good question deserves another. Why the f am 
I doing all the work? Come on, Vaulty. Ass jerky don't make itself. Jerky. <laughs> That's gross. But biggest muscle in the body. <laughs> I love the way they do that with the titles. Morning, Woody. Morning, Reg. Nice work on your posters. Well, thanks, Reg. I've been admiring yours as well. I asked him all sorts of questions. Who he is, who he works for, why his colleagues kidnapped Overseer McLean, what organizing principle, if any, they operate under. Nothing, huh? Uh, What's he doing? Oh, no. Sir, please stop. You will injure yourself. We better trank him again. For his own safety. We'll try again tomorrow. There you are. Thought you might be up here. Made pie if you'd like a piece. You came here to talk to me about what I said at the assembly. It upset people. You don't like it when people get upset. What do you do? With your sister gone, you're the last standing McLean. Your voice carries more weight than you might realize. During the raid, I got into storage space and I hid. Does that make you angry? Regular boys can get angry and they'll just pee on the wall. Clever boys like you are angry. <laughs> You're lucky not to have seen where that can lead. Just tread lightly. That's all I ask. Yeah, I think she's rooting. I think she's secretly rooting for him. It's gross. <laughs> What's going through your head right now? What are you? Oh, I'm you, sweetie. You just give it a little time. <laughs> Where are you going? so far wow okay oh i like it i like it it's rough but i like it i like it that dude's intense hey i thought i'd just stop by and see how you're doing how are you handling the uh death of the father of your unborn baby <laughs> He took great care of his shoes. Get him talking about shoe maintenance, and he, he'd just carry on until everyone left the room. <laughs> I loved him so much. Oh, oh Bird. Bird. Oh, Bird. Yes. I am Bird. It's the moon that gives it. Uh, oh man. Super duper mart. Transaction? Yes? Two month supply of aisles. Exchange one female, mint condition. Near mint condition. Condition grading requires physical evaluation. Please send her in. What's in that? You're about to find out. You're selling me? You got problems out here too, sweetheart. Best you try your luck behind that door. 
Super Duper Mart really does have everything. <laughs> I love how they use the music in this show to be so wholesome and yet so creepy. <laughs> Welcome. Only a General Atomics International Mark IV. That's what I am. You seem to be a woman. I say you've lost a finger. Ah, that won't do at all. Let's get you taken care of. Follow me. Now, what have we here? Too fat, too withered. Ah, this one will do it. Thank you. I, I, say. I really do appreciate this. That's much better, isn't it? I mean, I thought I was here to be a sex slave. What? No! What a disgusting idea! I'm simply going to harvest your organ. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Is there a tray incoming? Wait, they're getting jello cake? Those are my orders. I wonder what your dad would say about this. He'd be handing on the cake himself. Yeah, he was a saint. Do you want it? Nobody's mm. gonna know. What are you looking at? A murderer in a cage? Paying the price for what you did to us. For what you did to the innocent people in Vault 32. I don't know what the people of Vault 32 were up to, but it was anything but innocent. Yeah, he's going to go back over there and find out what's what. Never a good sign. Norm. Hi. <coughs> Feel like getting out of the house? Yes. <coughs> Messing with me, but one of the raiders told me there was something up at 32. Oh, that's right, they blew so it up. Long. I was wondering, okay, yeah. You see, whatever happened here happened a long time ago. Last bio signal detected was two years ago. That fork in a toaster. So if they were already dead when the raiders got here, who killed them? I mean, it looks like they strangled each other with their hands. We know the truth. Ooh, mystery deepens. That's not creepy at all. Pardon the interruption. Our latest arrival has arrived. Oh, do her now so she's ready for the next pickup. Excellent idea as always, sir. Thanks, Snap Snap. Where are you from again? Never been there myself. Hope to go there some days. <laughs> Let's get on with it, shall we? We don't want to keep your associate waiting. A little snip snip and it will all be over. Hands up. 
Do as I say and Snip Snip doesn't get hurt. It's a robot. Yeah, you might as well be holding an air conditioner hostage. <laughs> an air conditioner would be a big deal, but you know what I mean. Totally. Snip Snip, tell them what a Braxo does to the human body. It's very poisonous. Okay. You can walk out of here. Them too. Hey, thank you. I said all of them. Lady, those those ones you don't understand. Don't be scared. He's You're so naive. Free. Yeah, they're too far gone. Someone in there, talk to me. Time to wake up, girl. This is the real world. Pardon me, ma'am. Could I help you have a better day? No, thank you. How do you adapt, man? How do you adapt? You're stuck in a world that's 200 years gone. to say they went bananas. It still doesn't explain how the raiders got in. Death to management. <laughs> These people were crazy. It says it was open from the outside. No. They need a pit boy to open the door. They had one. Who's? Moms. Oh, Pip Boy, that's what that thing's called. I can never remember what it's called. Man, their mom is uh questionable. You don't get these. You turn into one of those. That how it works? I may end up looking like you, but I'll never be like you. Golden rule. Uh oh, now you're beholden to her. A horde. Oh, I bet he sees himself. Mm-hmm. Radiation King. <laughs> There's an old Mexican eulogy. Feo, fuerte, y formal. I hope you like the taste of lead, you commie son of a... All right. <laughs> Pretty cool. Such a good shot, such a good job with this series. I love the intensity behind it. Like you go from you go from this cheesy kind of of comedy to like just this dead serious reality. 
in this world. And it, they just, and they'll flip it on a switch real quick. I just love how they do it. The writing's really, really good in this. So I'm, I'm really happy with this. So where's Lucy? Well, she's going, she needs to get her dad, but she doesn't have the head. So what's a ghoul going to do? Didn't see Maximus at all this time, right? So Max is out there. We haven't seen him. Um, or Thaddeus, his knight, his squire. Um, and the mom had something to do with Vault 32 going down. Like, so there's something rotten in Vault Tech. I'm willing to bet it has something to do with the Enclave. It just feels like that's all starting to, like, kind of string together, right? Like, these guys were getting ready to be picked up or something. So they told, they told Snip Snip to get her done pretty quickly for the, for the, because they were showing up soon or whatever. Like I get the feeling like the Enclave is like the science place. So maybe that's where like the vault tech came from. Cause the target knew about McLean. He knew about Lucy. He knew about 33, 32 and 31. He knew about all the vaults and everything. So man, I really like how this is going. I'm liking it a lot. What about you? Do you like it? You love it? You hate it? How you feel? Do me a favor. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Subscribe if you have not. Ring the little bell so you get notifications every time when I post a new video. Um, we'll keep you updated. Share this with your friends, families, loved ones, and complete strangers. But most importantly, please drop me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. Let me know what you think. You want me to do this better? You want me to do this different? I'm getting used to like, this is the first time I've really like gotten into <clears throat> reacting to um, movies and, and TV. And uh, so I'm like learning the editing behind it. The last one took forever to get edited because it kept getting copyright claimed. Um, and I had to work around that and re-edit and re-edit until I finally got it up way late. Uh, so hopefully this one will come up a little bit sooner. But hang with me. I'm getting through it. We'll get together. Anyway, listen, y'all have a good one. Thanks so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed it. In the meantime, y'all be good. I love you. God loves you. Stay cool. Peace.